Dix's Midnight Runners like to think their music is pure. For them, the way to achieve this is through self-discipline. As a group, they practice hard and physically train hard together. They prefer tea to alcohol and drugs and regularly go for a collective run, usually three or four miles, even in this weather. It's the fact that we train together gives us a strength that a lot of other groups haven't got. The fact we are together it gives us a unity. And we feed off each other when we run it. You know, it's not just eight individuals running. We do try and help each other. We encourage each other. I don't think there's any way we could get through our hour to hour stage show without being as fit as we are. You know, another reason, um, you feel great mentally as well when you're fit. And it's not something you know until you've experienced it. But you think more clearly, you get up in the morning, you feel great. It, it just sort of came a time for us and we no longer thought it necessary to go around getting drunk or... Yeah. It just seems it's the right thing for us. I think it's definitely a good thing that people are challenging the accepted way to live, that you know that you should drink to excess, go out every night, get drunk, and that smoking's the thing to do. But Dex's attitude to physical fitness is shared by other young people. I was pretty disgusted with uh, what I saw the uh, older generation, like uh, you see guys going around with stomachs big in their chest and uh, you know, they're pretty, I didn't want to look like that. There's not a lot of jabs going around, and it's a lot of spare time. And uh, I think it'll help you more if you're a lot fitter. I think you'll look a lot better if you get big muscles. A lot less being shut around by other kids if you, if you look big. You know, I think twice about it. Open to suggestions is not the way.